it's really a reaction to last season. I mean, that's how we get anywhere, you know. It just was nice to see something graphic and simple. The Damier Square is almost as iconic for Louis Vuitton as the monogram, but there was nothing classic about what Marc Jacobs did with it today. I wanted to ride that escalator. It looked like heaven up there. It's like a fashion show with beautiful clothes, but at the same time, there is something more behind it. It's like a fantastic art installation. Louis Vuitton is an iconic brand that sort of transcends all the eras, really. I fell in love with all those beehive hairdos. I loved all the prints and the tiny wee short hemlines, and I thought it was magical. There's the next level that you have to get to with Vuitton in luxury. I think the expectation with the workmanship now is so high, you know, you have to try and better yourself every time. And whereas we enjoyed the simplicity of t-shirt dresses covered in sequins at Mark, you can't really just do that here. So they had to be microscopic sequins that were all hand embroidered. We like kind of those challenges. The sequins were stacked in sort of intervals to create dimension between the mesh that they were applied to. And this tough taj, this carpet technique where all those squares were actually embroidered and then the threads were cut to make a velvet relief. I mean, it was crazy, silly stuff that you can't even see without being up close. I thought it was amazing good fun, actually. Kind of very up. The colors were so fresh. I mean, we've seen so much black. And also the clothes were really beautiful. Some of those little checkered minis that you could see through, but not quite. And when you've seen so much transparency, I thought, okay, that one kind of really, you could fly with that one. And I love the Arbus twin quality, this sort of shining weirdness of the whole thing. I thought it was really, I don't know, kind of perverse. <laughs>